Welcome to the Lotus Goddess Divine Love. Hi everyone. How's everyone doing today? Hope we're doing well and staying safe. Welcome back everyone. Welcome if you're new to my channel. I do Divine Mask and Divine Feminine Twin Flame Journey Charm Readings. And let's begin and just keep in mind that this is a general reading. See what message comes through. And if this doesn't resonate, that's okay. You can have a look at one of my other readings. These readings are timeless. There's somebody here trying to fool Divine Masculine. I see here talking very sweet, uh, talking as if they are trying to support Divine Masculine. This It shows here it is a family member. A family member trying to fool Divine Masculine, trying to be sweet about something or trying to sound like everything's okay. There's something that, that they were doing to Divine Masculine that was unfair. This kept Divine Masculine confused. Masculine was not sure why certain things were not working out. They didn't know what the cause of it was, but I see here that it is connected to this family member. So somebody who this Divine Masculine trusts, it's like talking, like a sweet talker, like talking, talking good. They sound good, but there's something something else there. It's not what, they are not what they seem to be, basically. I see her playing some sort of game. They're not honest. So dishonesty here, playing some sort of game with Divine Masculine. Divine Masculine not being fully aware of the intentions of this person because they trust them and because they, they care for them, they love them. They may be living under the same roof or they come from the same family. So this is like close family members, very close family members. Masculine tried to move out of the home. I see her trying to move out of the home. At one point they did, but then they came back. This person used the motion to bring masculine back home. So if this masculine was living with this family member and masculine moved out of the home for whatever reason, this family member used emotions to bring masculine back. So masculine returned back to the home or to the house, wherever that they were living at. I see that this person, this family member keeps distant from divine feminine here. Divine Feminine, you have a very strong connection to the Divine. This Divine Feminine does a lot of prayer, connects to the Divine, speaks to God, and this person feels your energy. They feel your presence. Like something about you bothers them energetically. So this is the reason why this person has it feels like they propelled themselves away they are propelled away from you because of your energy because you are so connected to the divine you are somebody of a high vibration and it's kind of like your your light is so bright that they cannot see it they cannot see it that they have to stand from a distance it's like your light is blinding them so i see that this family member keeps distance from divine feminine here and when it comes to divine masculine they sense that divine feminine can read them well like you read this person well so you you know who this person is whoever this resonates for you already know who this family member is and they know that you know they know that you know how they are and they keep distance from you for that reason and at the same time, they keep close eye on Divine Masculine here. 
So they are very sweet with their words and in their, I feel like, in their behavior towards Divine Masculine. They do this in order to stay very close to Divine Masculine, to keep an eye on Divine Masculine. And at the same time, they keep distance from you. I see here, Divine Feminine, when you figured it out, when you figured out this person, in the beginning, it was a bit of a shock because it was someone who you didn't expect to get, get some kind of like, like you didn't expect a certain kind of behavior or something like that. You may have seen something, you may have heard something, you may have experienced something from this person and that you didn't expect to experience or see or know. And you may have even shared a bit of information with your Divine Masculine in the past. But I feel like you were guided not to show, show or disclose too much to Divine Masculine because you knew that they would not be ready to hear it because of the trust or the connection that this Divine Masculine has to this person. So this person, this family member is quite close to Divine Masculine and Divine Feminine, you knew what kind of person this person is. You may have given hints to Divine Masculine but you, you knew enough that I can't disclose too much because masculine is too close to this person. They might not hear you out, that kind of thing. You felt like maybe they won't trust me or they might not trust what I say about this person or maybe they're not ready to hear the truth about this person. So I feel like you gave subtle hints about what you knew and what you do know, but that was it. Like I, I see you, you were intuitively guided to not disclose too much at that time. There was something about the, the process between you and Divine Mask and so your path together there was some sort of delay. This delay is connected to this family member, whether you know it or not, but I see it here as there's a connection between the pace of your relationship. So if, you're, if your relationship with masculine started off pretty good, and then all of a sudden you felt like things started to slow down, started to take a little bit more time, it is connected to this person. This person may have gotten involved in some sort of way where you were not aware of this involvement and it caused some sort of delay. So delay meaning like in your relationship, things didn't move as smoothly as it should have. Things slowed down. The pace of the relationship, the connection didn't grow as much as it could have at the time. There's this thing about if masculine were to approach divine feminine here to try to restore the connection, rebuild the relationship between them and divine feminine, they feel like there's going to be a lot of tension, like a lot of people who are not going to be for it. On one hand, they want to be with you. And on the other hand, they feel like there's going to be a lot of a lot of disagreements. They know that in order to be with Divine Feminine, that means to disconnect or remove certain people from their life. So that means like no longer talking to certain people. Some cases they feel like they might be like disowned in some sort of way. I see here that the separation between masculine and some family members is quite harsh. And they know that reality that that's going to take place if I, if I choose to be with my divine feminine.
that means I will lose some of these family members because they will not be, I see here, they will not, some of them will not be happy about Divine Masculine being with, with Divine Feminine here. They want your Divine Masculine to stay with them. They don't want Divine Masculine to start a new beginning. But Divine Masculine would talk about wanting to start a new beginning, start something new, a new way of living. They're tired of the same old routine. This Masculine has prepared themselves for a new future. So a better future. I see here prepar uh, preparation. They may have, you know, done a lot of work, like work overtime to save money, that kind of thing. So I see here trying to really establish themselves, build a strong foundation before they move towards you because they know in the past it was not easy for them to to leave the home. So where they were where where they were at. Remember how I mentioned that this this masculine may have left the home and returned? They did that because one, it was the emotions that this person was expressing to Divine Masculine that kind of like drew Divine Masculine back to the home. And two, because this Divine Masculine was not financially stable enough to secure a home for themselves. I feel like this person, this family member may have talked this Divine Masculine to returning they may have said something along the lines of, you know, if you're home, it'll be much easier for you. We're here to support you, that kind of thing. So what this masculine did was they started to work really hard on themselves. I see here trying to establish a strong foundation for themselves in preparation to restore connection with you. So that way, when they do connect with you, when they do move forward with you, they have a strong support for themselves. So they're trying to build themselves before they start a new a new beginning, so a new path. So this is a reading for today. I hope you like this reading. If you like this reading, please subscribe to my channel, leave a comment below, and thank you all for watching. Have a beautiful day. Bye.